this is a video on the latest UFOs I've been seeing, the literally unidentified flying objects. Um, unfortunately, I haven't been able to get any footage yet. Um, I had my um, iPad with me right next to me last week and I saw this most amazing thing in the sky. Um, it's the last one I'll tell you about. And, and literally I saw it and I just kind of started reaching for my iPad and I was like looking at it. And by the time I'd literally just got the iPad and opened it, it had just stopped. Um, and then I, I spend literally so long just like holding it up to the sky, <laughs> hoping to get some kind of who knows what, you know. But anyway, just this is only going to be quick because all I've seen in the past, I'm going to do this every month. All I've seen in the past, um, this is actually on the 19th of September, um, it was 7.30 in the evening, just two flashes, those, those really beautiful startling uh, flashes with green edges. And um, it was by the head of Scorpius constellation. And they were just static. They didn't really move, they just flashed once with the green edges and then flashed in the same position again. And then that was it. Um, it just stopped. So that was the 19th of September. And then on the 17th of October, I've been diarising it all, which is why I'm looking down and I'm reading it. On the 17th of October, I didn't put what time actually, it was obviously in the evening, there were six flashes, white flashes. And they were in, uh, around the constellation of Pisces. And I remember this because they were, they were just kind of the white ones irregular timing there wasn't um uh, you know there wasn't any uh, you know it's just it's not it's not regular at all and one of them was a beautiful slow motion and it was moving in a diagonal direction so it flashed then it moved a bit and flashed and the ones i really love is like this really it's like a dimmer switch has gone on and they just flash really slowly and then they move a bit and then suddenly there's a bright flash a quick one and then it moves and then a slow flash again so that was the 17th of october six flashes um constellation of pisces and they were mostly white and this one i saw last week was stunning i mean it was Oh, this is one where I was like reaching for my camera, but it was over a bit too quickly because what happened? So I put it's 10.50 p.m. And I've got here, I meant to check this out and I haven't actually. I've got here that it's in a constellation called Mensa by a star called Amen, <laughs> which I really didn't know existed. Amen, a star called Amen. Okay, Amen, Amen Ra. So yeah. So this is on the 22nd of October and this is what happened. It was just stunning. So I was looking up and there was like one flash. I tell you what happens. You kind of get a flash that maybe you don't always see straight on. It might just catch your attention because it's bright and you know, you might be looking over there and the flash is over there, but it catches your attention. So I looked in the area of the sky where I saw it and there was another flash. And I thought, oh, I've got my iPad right here. And I start, I was looking up, reaching for my iPad. And there was another flash. And I got my iPad and I was just opening it. And then right where these two flashes had been, this orange column of light descended through the sky with like a red core. It, it, you, you could have kind of said, oh, it's a shooting star, because it just went but it went straight down, it wasn't white, it didn't have any meteor, a tail or anything. It was like a, a, a column of orange light that came right down from where these flashes had been and in the centre there's this like red kind of core. It was stunning, breathtaking, astounding to see, 
I mean, I saw it and I'm, I, my jaw is open and I'm just like that. And unfortunately, it's been a bit wind. Well, unfortunately, it's been quite windy here. And so at night, it means that, um, you know, if you open your window, you just basically get oh, a complete wind um, attack kind of thing. And it's, we've had a few foggy nights and a bit of rain, thankfully. Um, so hopefully I'm going to do this by the month and by the end of November I'll make another video of what I've seen. But that one last week with the orange, the orange trail of light, this orange column of light. And now it would have been one thing if I'd have seen the two flashes and then I looked over to a different part of the sky and, and this column had been, you know, arcing or, um, you know, kind of like a star, a, a shooting star or whatever. But to have this orange column of light right where these two flashes had been, I mean, for me, it's it's a you know it's it's quite straightforward. It's obviously to do with um, wonderful things that are going on in the sky. So um, that's it. Thank you for watching, and hopefully, fingers crossed, I will get at some point um, video footage of these wonderful um, phenomena. So yeah, cool.